Hey guys, so this is it bringing you another video. Now today we're doing another episode of Platinum 2 Diamond and right now I think we're somewhere in Platinum 2. I haven't done one of these episodes in a long time as I wanted to put more diamond content on the channel and then we had my whole like arm problem and everything that I had surgery. So yeah, it's been a bit rough. But if you do want to skip champion select below the camera right now will be an option if you're on a device that allows it uh, and then you can just skip directly to uh, the LOL Nexus screen or the loading screen, which I normally put the skip function to. Uh, so I actually, I'm in Champions League right now, <coughs> obviously, and I've actually asked for AD carry. Now, a lot of you would be like, ha? Huz, I thought you hated bot lane. And the thing is, I've never really, I don't hate bot lane. Um, I used to be an AD carry main a long time ago. Before I started YouTube, I used to main AD carry. And I don't know why, but I've got the bug to play it again. For the past just over a week, I'd say, any time I'm playing solo queue and I've been streaming, I've actually play, been playing AD carry whenever I can. As I've just been enjoying it, it's, it's that simple, you know. I'm not picking AD carry because I want to win more. I'm not picking AD carry because I think I'm better at it. It's literally just because I'm in the mood to play it. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll see how it goes. If I am AD, then I'll be probably picking Graves, as I'm having the most fun with him, and I'm not AD carry. Ah, <laughs> but anyway, now you kind of know that I'm in the mood to play AD, so expect some AD carry content to come up on the channel soon. Uh, today's video should be coming out, like, today. I'm recording it on Boxing Day, which is the, the 26th. I'll record it today, upload it today. And then starting next week, content should resume as normal, starting on Wednesday. As tonight, on the 26th, I'm actually going away for the whole weekend. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah, I can't make any videos while I'm away. So, uh, yeah. Right. So there is a Fizz pick, there is a Varus pick. Um, I'm not sure where I'm going to go. Now the one thing, oh, here we go, this is what I kind of say these people kind of annoy me, is there's this guy, this crafty or whatever your name is, jungle slash top only, like why is that only word there? Like you have to be so much more flexible when you're in solo queue, otherwise you're just going to come across as a, a not nice person. <laughs> um, Sins or Cho'Gath, I'd prefer neither because both of them are pretty bad, but uh, uh, so I might be support this game. Uh, I'm not uh, gonna cry about it, but, uh, yeah, okay. So we have Singed. I don't think Singed is very useful. Never have. Uh, or, or that saying Cho'Gath isn't really useful either, but, yeah. <clears throat> right. So if I am support, Leona is my probably go-to versus Avaris. Because what does Varus not have? Varus doesn't actually have any escape. He has, obviously, his bind with his ultimate... But he has no dash ability. He only has flash in theory. So, yeah, I'll, I probably will go Leona. Like, this guy, I'm surprised he hasn't even locked in already. Um, you know, I'd, I'd like to a uh, jungle, seeing that is technically still my main role. But I'm not going to um, argue about it. Right. The dawn um, has arrived. But yeah, oh well. So we are playing a Leona game. I'm against a Thresh, which Thresh is pretty good versus Leona, if it's a good Thresh. But in High Platinum, I doubt we're going to get amazing Threshes. Um, bom, bom. I am copying Crepo's Masteries right now, as I don't really know support Masteries. And I'm going to take Ignite as well, because I feel like I want to get some kills. Oh, I have a skin for Leona, because I bought the pool party set on this account. Nice. Okay, yeah, so we're playing Leona. Um, Leona, Caitlyn, is, it's not a lane that usually goes together, but Caitlyn is a strong AD carry, and I'm against... The main reason I picked Leona is because I'm against the Varus. Other options of what I could have potentially done on this account, Brom, I could have done. He wouldn't have been a terrible pick. Uh, what else? Morgana. Again, that wouldn't be terrible. A lot of poke, but I don't know. I'm in the mood to play the owner. Jump on top of people's faces. Uh, we're very AD heavy. I am going to go... Ooh, what am I going to go rune-wise? What's it better? It's probably actually better to go physical. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll put some CDR in the blue. 
Like, as I've always said, every single video, pretty much, I do not have good runes on this account. Um, and <clears throat> this is the difference between if you're a main account and I'm a smurf, you should have good runes if it's your main account. You know, I'm getting to diamond with horrible runes, so hopefully you guys will be able to do a little bit better in that department than me. Um... It's actually just really interesting. Um, Talon actually just swapped to Exhaust. That's surprising. Uh, normally Talons, you kind of want to just go all in on a kill. But uh, obviously our Talon isn't really that confident, maybe? I don't know. Bit weird. So, uh, hurrah, we didn't actually get a bug splat. I've actually been getting bug splats pretty much every single game for the past week or so. I've been told it's something to do with my new Logitech mouse, that it's something in the files that makes things bug splat, but I have no idea. I've removed the Logitech files and nothing's happened. Um, but yeah, welcome if you did skip Champion Select. Um, we are now in the loading screen, so just to kind of give you the team comps, Caitlyn Singe, Talon, Leona, Lee Sin versus Fizz, Varus, Thresh, Nocturne, and Nasus. Uh, so as a kind of overall who do I think will win out of team comps, I think it's up in the air right now. It depends if our Lee Sin gets ahead of the Nocturne. It depends how we do in bot lane. Top lane is a pretty big lane because I'm not a big fan of Singed at all. Plus this Singed has not got teleport. That's a big no-no in my book. Uh, because Singed, you're not really a killing top laner, are you? You, you know, You're somebody that is annoying. You run around. You become very tanky. You don't really go for kills, so why is he taking Ignite versus Anasus? Like, so we could be in a bit of trouble if it gets to late game and they have a split pushing Nasus that can teleport in and we don't have a split pusher at all. Uh, but here we go. We are in game. So unfortunately, Lol Nexus took so long, I actually don't have, didn't have time to actually bring up the screen. Uh, but I can tell you, as it's just popped up now, so I'll tell you, we are against... Pretty much just Platinum. So bot lane, if we just focus on bot lane, we're against a Platinum 2 Thresh and a Platinum 2 Varus. The Thresh is 200 games and the Varus is 16. Both of them with okay KDAs. Uh, and my Caitlyn is Platinum 3 with only 8 games played on Caitlyn. Um, the Talon in mid lane is Gold 1. So he's most likely duo Q with somebody. Uh, but yeah. We should do okay. Um, so I, mm, we can actually probably fight them. Oh, I don't know where you're going, though. Okay, Thresh just took, like, a, right, he's got the wrong item. Blah. Right, so right now there are only pretty much two viable support items in the game. One of them being the AP support item, and the other one being the Relic Shield. <clears throat> Reason for this is because the meta right now is either AP damage or tankiness. The only support, and this is like literally the only support that I think it's okay, still not the best, it's okay to go uh, that talisman item, the ancient coin, is Janna. And that's the only one. Um, you know, Blitz, like the tankiness, if you're a melee, you get the 75 health, you get the regen back for your AD carry. When you last hit, you get more gold for yourself. Uh, the AP one gives you more damage, gives you a slow, and then the Ancient Coin, like, it gives you some more gold. Uh, it doesn't give you any pressure in lane, you know, it doesn't give you the shield or anything like that. So, yeah, I'm not a massive fan. Um, I'm gonna take Q first. I actually cancelled my auto attack then. Oops. Right, so, Leona. Leona is an a uh, support um, that kind of gets into the front line and you've got to be very careful of when you're actually going to engage as if you don't engage at the bad time you can really muck up basically um i've seen many leonas go in at really poor times and just die out of like nothing um so yeah right hopefully caitlin doesn't get poked too much i'm presuming uh thresh took e first he's taking a bit of free damage which is nice Ah, uh, Caitlyn actually missed a CS there because she went for the Piltover. Um, so yeah, I have to wait for level 2. Oh my god, that was close. Damn! So he did take E first. So one thing with uh, this matchup is obviously as a Leona, when you Zenith Blade in, Thresh can flay you away. It's fairly easy to do if you're a half-decent Thresh, but normally you'll be okay. 
Um, so we're against a Nocturne, so I'm not really actually that scared of early ganks unless he comes from behind. And the, the chances of him actually coming from behind right now uh, is very, very, very low. Okay, so I want to take the cannon. There we go. Nice. So Caitlyn, I think she's actually last hitting quite well. She's on 16, Varys is on 13, but he does have actually this. If he gets all of them, he's actually ahead. I think she's missing too many, or missing a couple, because she's trying to um, pilt over too much. Like, you can see her mana is already quite low. Uh-oh. Yeah, she's taking a bit of free harass. Like, I'm full health, and yeah. Again, pilt over. I don't see the need right now, to be honest. We're pushing anyway, you don't need to use your mana. Because if we get into a fight, we're pretty much oh God, pretty much screwed. Nice free poke. That Thresh, both, every single one of his hooks has been really off target. So that's kind of a good thing for us. Just gonna ward that. As like, mm, maybe I shouldn't have warded that. Probably shouldn't have. I thought they were gonna start pushing against us, but we're still pushing to them, which is actually interesting. Like, Leona offers no pushing power really, where Thresh actually offers some. So, well, if he actually auto attacks the wave again, pilt over for no reason. She got one last hit for using like, was it fifty or sixty mana? It's not worth it. <clears throat> That Thresh is not good at landing hooks. Ah, uh, first blood, top lane. Top lane is the, t the lane I am really worried about, I'll be honest. <clears throat> now, okay, here's what I say about chat in League of Legends. What is the need for that lead to say obvious? Like, if you're somebody that's sitting right now at home going, yeah, it's fine he said that, then you are part of the problem. Like, adding that little obvious gives you no advantage to winning the game at all. All right. Okay, we, we got so much more damage than them. That was really nice. Damn. It would have been nice if I didn't take that last Q there, but it's okay. Uh, but yeah, that... What's the point? Like, you're just going to put people in a, a worse mood. Oh, that's not good. Damn, I died from the tower pretty much. He died at 25 health. And Caitlyn died too. That was her fault from, like, getting hooked under tower. But yeah, damn. Would have been nice if Varus died. Um, what item am I gonna go now? Am I gonna increase? No, I'm actually gonna get a ruby crystal. But yeah, that's unfortunate. This is why like always pushing is not all always a good thing. Singed is dead again, and what you have to always kind of say is Singed has the ignite. Nasus has teleport, and Nasus is already killing him one on one. So. Top lane is pretty much screwed, and that is going to potentially cost us the game, considering um, our Singed could be useless. Mm, Alright, nice. Oh, we can actually pick up a few kills here. Okay, no, we can't. If they will be like, oh, this Caitlyn just uses Piltover too much. I have to say it, like, she's using so much mana. Like, that, that, like, having no mana in a potential, like, 2v2 fight could be the reason why you lose it. Like, oh, she did it again. <laughs> why? Ugh. Hmm. Right, he's got a BF sword, we have a pickaxe. Okay. Maybe I should have just gone all in on the Varus. Like, one, one, one more auto attack would have killed him, but I thought he was dead anyway. Mm, he was on 25 health. Which sucks. I'm going to save my stack for the cannon. Using more mana for no reason. He's level 6. What you do not want to do right now is get caught out by um, Ultimate or something. Fizzbot, okay. 
Caitlyn is interesting, I'll put it that way. Hmm. Rally to me. This is the only, like, I'm, as I've, I mentioned in Champion Select, I'm playing a lot more AD carry right now, just for fun. I'm really enjoying it. The only downfall, if you're a support main or you're an AD main, is you actually have to rely on another person. That's kind of what I like about top lane and... Uh, jungle and mid lane is that you can win your lane hundred percent just by yourself. If you play well, you win. Bot lane, it's a lot. You can do it if you're really, really good, but it's a lot harder to do that. So yeah, Caitlyn's not playing great right now. <clears throat> Nasus has no flash right now. Honestly, I don't think they can. Singe has zero damage, and Lee Sin has damage, but Nasus is miles ahead because he has Sheen. I don't think that would be a good idea. Right, I'm gonna kill the cannon with my stack. Oh my god, she hasn't used the Piltover yet. I'm waiting for it. I will protect you. This is a miracle right now. We can potentially kill them when I'm level 6. The sun always nah, I need level 7. Nasus just watered the river. First light approaches. I don't know where Nocturne is, because he could be behind the tower here. Oh, look, Nasus ganked mid lane when they were trying to kill him top lane. And he's just going to go and pick up a kill. Yeah. Ugh. This game is really not going well. We did it. See, there we go. We played it a lot better. Like she, she's still nearly oom, but there's the thing. If she counted, like she stopped using piltovers millions of times. Imagine if she didn't. She was oom then. We were dead. Like it's really. There we go. He could. Wow. Okay. I think he must have tower dived. Um, but because she actually had mana, enabled us to fight. Therefore, we got a double kill. Plus, they kind of stacked up for a double Leona roll, but still. Um, you know, it, I think Caitlyn having mana there was kind of the biggest thing. So that's good. That's really good. And we get bot tower. Get the last hit. Nope. I'll go ward it. I don't really know what the ping is for, though. Oh. What the hell? Why are you bot lane? That Nasus is playing a bit weird, like why? Huh. I'm gonna stay. Boom, baby. Get wrecked. There it is! I think I got a triple Nasus, uh, triple um, thingy out again. Bum, 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 bum. Alright. So that. Into that. Alright, that's really good. Now Caitlyn is now fed. <laughs> See, things can just swap over like that if you just start playing it well. The only problem with this game is I think we're going to have a useless singe and I think our Talon is getting owned uh, by Fizz. And Fizz is like... Okay, Talon's got more CS, but Fizz, I think, has kill pressure. Um... So it's going to be interesting. Singe might be dead. Mm. Like, yeah, I, I'm not a big fan of Singe. We can do this, like, for free. Okay, he might live. Yeah, he's lived. That's good. He's 
Make it confused. There we go. <clears throat> right, bot lane is missing. They're fighting top lane. They should actually get that kill. That'd be really good. I'll go up for Lee Sin. Nice kick. Nice kill. Well played. I want to go get some deep wards. Now that we've got like a lot of pressure. Why is Caitlyn backing? Oh, she might have IE. Oh, man. I wanted to try and steal that with ult. <laughs> but whoosh. Alright, they get top tower. That's good. Okay, that's they're making stuff happen, which is actually really good. You know, I could probably like nearly kill this virus right now, which is really funny. Ever vigilant. Mm-hmm. 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 Where's Kate? Oh god, she's mid. I should probably go mid then. Alright, yeah, run, 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 run. Run, Leona, run! What happened? Where's the ult? Did he? Oh, I think he dumb goofed. What I think happened was he used it when he was out of range. Oh my god, three kills. Nice. Okay, go mid tower. Very kill. Whoa, I got all three of my thingies then <laughs> for my, uh, what's it called? What's this one? Targon's Brace. Embrace or Embrace? Embrace. Alright, I tank two shots just to give the tower a little bit of, uh, or the minions a little bit of a head start. Alright, I'm going to go up to top lane. Alright, put my ignite on him. Just to have extra damage. There we go, free kill. Now get this tier 2. So this is really good. We're rotating. We're getting objectives. There's a fish. Oh, Alright, time to get out. Alright. We did overstay, but that's okay. Caitlyn actually might pick up maybe one more kill. Oh, the god! Nah, he, she's dead. Okay, we overstayed. It's fine. We overstayed and still got a lot. We overstayed and we still got four of them. So that's completely fine. Um... What one do I know? I might get actually this. Yeah, I'm gonna get that. Singed, go tanky. We don't need you as damage. If Singed goes damage, that's really bad. Like, all we need him is a tank just to peel for Caitlyn, and we win the game. Like, get a Thorn Mail. Like, Talon still wrecks an AD carry. It's Talon, so he is still useful. 100% still useful. If Caitlyn comes bot lane, we can kill this Nasus fairly easily. Now, what the Nasus is... Right, here's the thing. Nasus was winning lane really, really, really easily versus Singed. I get that. Because you're winning lane, you kind of feel on top of the world, build damage. He's built a Triforce, but now Caitlyn's got really fed. It's basically made him, in theory, useless. In theory. Because, like, look, look how squishy that is. Like, that is ridiculously squishy. And that's their main tank. Or should be their main tank. Like, this game practically could be over if uh, none of them build tanky. <clears throat> Might be able to catch somebody here. Oh, boy, I'm coming. Okay, that did not go well. They, When I went in, they all jumped on my squishies. Okay, I need to stay with my squishies. 
Uh, see, that's a problem. Lee Sin really shouldn't fight. Lee Sin should start building tanky now as well. That's a good that we got another tower. Well done. Um, I'm going to mute this Lee. Like, he's not really offering that much. Just like, no. I know that, like, that stop throw comment isn't worth me muting him. It's just been the combination of him in the whole game that's kind of just made me a bit annoyed with him. So just mute him. Rally to me. So he's got an IE, he's building his probably uh, static ship. Drake, 30, all be there. Um, yeah. There you go. It's good that Lee's getting that turtle, whatever it's called, crab. That's the one. Uh, before, because obviously it comes up a little bit before. Okay, that Nocturne build is terrible too. Oh, there's a pink there. Do dragon. Oh no, what are you doing? Oh, okay, me and Caitlin will do it. They'll have to get through me. Okay, take the blue and the pink. Where's Sin's go? Oh. Get on him. I must not Got him. We wand. Alright, Fizz is up. risking it that was really good though they kind of like just clumped like if i had my if i saved my leona ult just a little bit if i hit my four man leona ult here that would have been like easily a one fight but we won it anyway so it's not that bad okay uh, uh there we go <laughs> took so long Uh... Damn it. Oh well. That's kind of predictable, but uh, that's kind of my bad for basing. Me and Caitlyn based at different times, so I was kind of left to dry when she went back. But Alright, Varus just missed my pink with us being like the whole game. Um, what's their damage? So they've got... I'm not scared of the Nocturne at all. Like, he's he just focused me there, sure, but he, in a real fight, he's not going to. Varus is strong, so I'm just going to build armor. Like, the Fizz shouldn't go on me, in theory. If he does, then that's actually a good thing. Yeah, that Caitlyn shouldn't fight him one-on-one. -on -one. Varus is a stronger one-on-one -on -one champion than a Caitlyn. Like, he's got an ultimate that damages straight away. Um... And Caitlyn obviously doesn't have an ultimate that damages straight away. She has to charge it so she can't use it in a 1v1 fight unless they're running away. Damn, dude. The hell's going on? Rally to me. I'm gonna put a ward like here. Oh, and 25. Like, we can secretly do Baron really quickly. But it is risky. Oh, get out of there. I 
Alright, there's a ward in there. There's no ult low, which is actually really good. Just kind of looking for ult opportunities. Talon's bot lane, so we can't fight. Don't fight. And Talon is bot. Alright, Fizz is bot. We can actually. Mm. Don't know about that. Ever vigilant. We can. Me? Mm, do we have enough damage? I don't know. I don't have a pink ward. Does anybody have a pink ward? Mm, this is risky, but why not? YOLO. Caitlyn needs to stand like right there. Okay, she's not doing it. Okay, we need to get out. Wait, we got Baron? Whoa, I didn't realize we got Baron. I will protect you. Where's Thresh? Don't die, Lee. <laughs> God. Uh... I, I didn't even realize we got Baron. Like, I, I thought the Baron was still at like 4,000 health when we started like disengaging off of it. Right, I'm gonna get that now. Finish it just after shield. But like, Fizz is a threat if, if uh, he gets on Caitlyn. So, use the shield pretty much. Uh, he walked into that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> they should be okay. Alright, yeah, well, if we uh, go mid, we can just own them. <laughs> Okay, tell her not it. Okay. There we go. Easy. Why do we need to do dragon? Like, to get the... Free kill. Alright. There we go. So, like, Singed, has he gone tanky? He started to go tanky. He's still got a bit too much AP for my liking. But we're going to win this game. It wasn't looking good in the early stages, like the really early stages, but we managed to pull through. We got Caitlyn really good, like, fed and that, which obviously always helps when your AD carry is fed. And we did an okay job in protecting her. Like, she is 16-5, so she's done well. Um, so that is going to be this game. So content, again, will be resuming uh, next week. Um, and that was it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. This has been Leona Support. I'm not the best support in the world, but I... I do have an idea of what I am doing. So anyway, thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. So, goodbye.